Are you serious? Are you serious? Somebody has just stole the bridge. What? I've heard of like a bridge over troubled waters. Somebody just took this bridge down in Hammond, Indiana, really about an hour north of where I'm sitting. If I got on the interstate and just drove straight there, I could be there in about an hour. I just got this email. I want to thank Vicki out of North Carolina for actually sending me this. But here we go. A bridge in Hammond, Indiana has been stolen. How do you steal a bridge? Um, apparently, it's over the Grand Cal River, what's known as the Calumet River. Um, somebody, and I would say several somebodies, had to have went in there with torches. I mean, I'm talking about to cut down a bridge, to literally take a bridge down made of angle iron and steel, you would have to bring some, uh, you know, some very, I mean, you, have, you can't just show up there and say, I think I'll take a bridge. I mean, you're not Samson and Delilah here. You're not going to just walk up and grab a bridge and carry it away. Uh, so they had to, these have to be scrappers. Cutting away, must have worked all night. Had to be in a team of them. I mean, I mean, some of the bridge, I mean, obviously they took the bridge down. Now, this was an old railroad bridge. And the problem is that as they cut this bridge down, it finally collapses in what's left of it into the river and is starting to dam up the river and back the river up. Because these railroad ties are soaked in creosote, and of course that is uh, dangerous toxins for the uh, environment. Especially if it's in the drinking water or going on down. So somebody has stolen a bridge in Hammond, Indiana. Are you serious? I guess, uh, you know, the economy, I, I don't know. What, what can I say? Desperate times, people are getting desperate measures are taking place. What, what can I do with this? Somebody stole a bridge. So if people can actually steal bridges, what, what is their limitation, really? Uh, anyway, thought I'd just let you know this. It's kind of a crazy situation, but uh, anything's possible. Anything's possible. We're living in, we're living in perilous times uh, and, and crazy events. I'm Pastor Paul Begley. I live in Indiana, but I did not take this bridge. I'm trying to build a bridge, a bridge of hope, a bridge of peace to help lead people from the, the wilderness of life into the promised land of glory. And that bridge is Jesus Christ. He is the only hope. And you can't steal that bridge, folks. If you get on the bridge of Jesus Christ, the bridge between fallen humanity and divine glory. Nobody can steal that bridge. God bless.